Okay. We're doing the sub-65 teaching stream. Um, you bring two pieces of Ancestral to, like, quickly heal off things if you need to. Um, ideally, you're just healing off, like, Bloblets, and that's it, because you're wasting time if you're healing on other things. Peace fast for... Um, okay, like, most important things with a speedrun, if you're just after sub-65, it's not that complicated. It's always be divined. You have enough for a full run. This is 60 minutes of divine. Um, always be potted. Always be attacking something. And that's about it. <laughs> if you do those two things, you will get a sub-65. You can get do that up to sub-60 even. Like, it's still the same procedure. So, that's like the main thing. Now, there's a bunch of little things I'll talk about that like speed it up a little bit. But really, none of that is like super important. If you are potted and clicking stuff at all times, you will get it. It's it's not that hard. Um, okay. Oh, I guess we use Divine Bastion for pre-pot because I don't use Super Combat. Is this good? Yes, 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 yes. Where's the Chally? Man. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, go. Read my message quick. What is it? Right, read this so it's in the video. Wow, so handsome. Love him. Love Patchy. Nice. I don't know how to take a damn thing. I'm getting pretty close. Yeah, it's not too hard. Holy, there's a rock! <laughs> Are we good? Make sure I'm not wasting the task. No, should be good. Okay. You like beating Lola's PB? I think we can do it. I think so. Um, I guess I'm going to start here. This is not my normal start tile, but really I'm not showing like how to two tick or anything like that because you don't need it. I do this. Yeah. Well. Habits are kicking in. No Fally Shield. I'll be okay. <laughs> no Fally Shield, imagine. Alright. Not too much to talk about on the other ways. Drop a spec, do some damage. So when you kill a blob, it's just give it one cast and then start piping. <laughs> I can't start down here, man. Everything in me says don't go there. <laughs> when you're killing blobs, you can kill stuff in between. So you can always attack a bat like this. Give it a cast, come back to it. And um, nibblers are not priority. Not necessarily. You don't always have to clear off the nibblers. You kill things so fast, it doesn't really matter. Okay, I'm going to start here. I can do it. Okay. Oh yeah, I shouldn't be ice barraging either. Ice barrage prevents things from clumping up nicely. So right here, I could just kill them all. But I have Ice Barrage. Unlucky. So don't do that. Okay. Bevenged. Noted. Yeah, very important to get prevenged. I literally can't start on that tile. So I left that nibbler there so I could shoot it in between. Eh, I'm just gonna kill him. Uh, 
Uh, ideally, you want to kill the melee bloblets first because they die a tick slower. So I kill them before the other things. Wow. Okay, cool. Um, ideally, starting from center is good every wave up until... Up until 50. And then you want to start starting here. It's really just so you can do a two tick, though. Easy, Tebow. Don't do that. <laughs> Um, okay, I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna kill this. I'm gonna leave that nibbler. Leave a nibbler, so as the melee's dying, melees die really, really slowly. You can kill a nibbler. See, they died the same time. So save some time if you do that. Ideally, do not kill melees last if you can avoid it. So in this case, I'm just gonna go for the melee. And then kill the bat. Cheeky barrage on him. No, I can't do that. It's okay. Just get it out of the way. Okay, I'm going to kill you. And pray melee. I'm going to kill the Blobblet after. Blobblet's two dies slower, but it doesn't really matter because melee dies for a long time anyway. And I shouldn't be ice barraging. <laughs> I haven't done an Ancients wrong, an Ancients run in so long. I'm going to attack this bat in between on the cooldown. Okay, I should be blood barraging now. Zip a stem. I'm used to running around a lot too. I need to be pulling things in slower. I gotta change the way I play like completely. Let's let that melee start coming around. That's slower. I'm trying. <laughs> GM Rasta. Oops. Kill Blob. Attack melee in between. Get a cheeky little cast on both here. Nice. And 60 HP drop, I know, is them all dead, so. Shouldn't have dragged that. Not ideal. Shouldn't be ice barraging barrages every time. I use chins, bro. I'm not the barrage master. One nibbler's cool. I'll just leave it. And you really, the focus is not really flicking. You bring enough restore. I wish that died. Flicking is not really the focus. You bring enough restore that you don't really need to flick that much. Okay, let's hear uh, just him. Hmm. I know those aren't dead. I'm just going to kill it. Cool. I could have... Nah, it would have been better to leave that. It's fine. I could have killed the ranger, then come over and killed the nibbler. Nibbler dies a little faster than ranger. Not really a big deal. Okay, I'm gonna get the nibblers first. Being like flexible and not afraid of um 
Being flexible and not afraid to move out from pillar is really, really good for speeds. Waiting for stuff to pull in is very slow. You can do it a lot for a sub-65, but... It helps if on the safe ways you're running around and killing stuff. Uh, okay, let's do this. Oh, I should've just piped those. Yeah, they're done. We can just... We can kill a bat after this. Bat dies a little faster than Ranger. Might as well do him last. I'm gonna chill here. Who fucking cares? <laughs> Let's get over there and grab that. Cool. So a lot of it is just using your downtime, like, properly. When you're popping blobs, try to be attacking stuff. Oh no, I'm not potted. Let's repot instantly. Alright, there's a bat there. Shoot it in between. Kill this now. You see how I'm, I'm not super concerned about the Nibbler? It's not a huge deal. Grab it when I can. Texas with the two months. Thank you so much, my guy. You look dumb as hell. What? <laughs> you get one tick alternate too. It's a little easier to two tick, and I'm really used to it, but... One tick alternating is fine if you don't know how to do it. Don't worry about it. Let's start pulling that bat over. Remember, bat dies a little quicker, so we can kill him after the mage, after the ranger. Save a little bit of time. I want to show that dragon to pillars is fine, but I'm just so not used to it. A little bit of HP back. Let's drag the other ranger over here. Should have left that. I could have left that and killed it after the ranger. Not a big deal, though. It's like a one or two tick save. Okay, so always want to try and kill melee first. So I'm actually going to go over here and just bring him here. And you can remember monsters are pillars, so you can do a corner trap like this. Or I could have stood here and it would be safe spotted, like it can't get to me. Works too. Just don't be afraid to flex away from pillar. Like you don't have to sit next to it the whole time. Do you put the ranger in blob death? Yeah, that's huge. Ah, this could be wait. Oh yeah, equip your anguish as well. That's a good idea. I gotta kill that. Okay, why don't we just kill the melee? Starts teaching you furnace at world record time. I don't know about that one, Chief. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna start from here. I'm gonna try to force myself. I'm gonna try. <laughs> it's a little safer. Tebow! One damage! Uh, let's step to the middle so these drag out nice. Turn off the accelerate. Hit the emergency brake. Eat. 
Okay, that's gonna come down. So I'm just gonna let it come down. Okay. Sure. Oh, I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying, chat. I'm trying. It's hard. <laughs> Too much inferno. Okay, kill this bat. I'm trying to be slow. <laughs> Oh, I try to kill that blob first so I can use the downtime to attack this, and I can even back up here and get a nice little brush. Also, I'm trolling. Kill Ranger first. I'm not potted. Uh, we can get a nice little clump going here. Might as well. Or, like, actually barrage it would be a good idea. Cool. Melee's my priority. I don't want him dying last. That was a Benedir. Benedir angle right there. Okay, I pushed into that blob because I don't want to be sitting here. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to kill the melee. I will kill the blob and then I will kill the melee. Or kill the ranger, kill the blob, kill the melee. You can go here. That's okay. I kind of wanted that. Okay, I'm going to go here. I'm going to pray mage. And now I can kill the blob at last. Takes me a little bit of time. He only dies a tick after. Oh, yeah, that's the thing. And this is a no monkey speedrun. <laughs> okay. That's fine. We're going to go right a pillar. Your face is a speedrun. Stop being toxic! Let's get like max distance from this ranger and just go pipe this. Perfect. And they die the same tick, so saves a little bit of time. Flicking's not a big deal. The the prayer is not a concern. So it's get close to this ranger. If moving can save you time, move over there. This is too fast, I'm trying. <laughs> What can you do, man? If moving saves you time over flicking, you should be moving. So. Alright, cool. We're to majors. Oh, I thought that was dead. Cool. Now it is. You can get within one tile of the mage, and it's going to lower the travel time of your bow. So if you're anywhere within one tile, it'll be a little faster. I'm going to start here for now. Oh, this is a chin angle! Dude. 
in. Two here? Okay. All right, maybe just an awkward spot. Let's just kill the bats. Not a great spawn. Slow down. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> I'm putting the brakes on. Pegs or holy boots? Either work. It's it's really not that tight at all. You can, you can see I'm 55 predicted. I haven't done anything crazy. I'm not using chins even, so... Really, it's, it's stay potted, be attacking stuff at all times, and like, that's it. Okay, we can just drag him here. I'll give this another cast. Cool. Should you stay potted? Rigor's a cool prayer? It's very powerful. Little known fact. I don't think that killed him. That did. Let's move on. So don't be waiting for things to die. Just move up to the next thing. Just gets one cast. Okay. He lives with one HP average. This isn't a monkey speed run after all. Oh, the blog. What a big chillin'. So goal is always get to the mage first if you can. Um, in that case, I put a little bit of damage in the blob. I don't want to kill it though, because if it respawns a blob, all those bloblets also get respawned. So it's like a load of health you have to redeal. So if you can avoid killing things before the mage, that's good. And especially blobs. Blobs are bad. And what I can do here is that's dead. Shoot that. Let's kill these. Oh no, my West Pillar. That's so sad. I'm crying. Not oh, my West Pillar. Okay, let's just kill the bats. Killing bats isn't a big deal. Who cares if those respawn? 51's back, I'll take it. Okay, pretend I took a big hit there. Because <laughs> I'm not taking a lot of damage. I'm not messing up much. Let's say you just got hit down to 50. This is fine. You can do this a little bit. This is how we slow the run down, you see? If you're going to heal, do that. That's worth like 40 HP. Quickly gets you back on your feet if you ever make a mistake. I could get out of punching range of this. Do I really care? No. Not really. These provide health if I need to a blood barrage it back. Not a big deal. I have four brews. I can spend those as well. Neat trick you can do with this. Step here and it works. I should leave the mage. Nope. Leaves a ranger. Weird. Usually if one lives, it's the mage. <laughs> okay, this is melee. It's free. Yeah, cool. Go out there. Get him. Let's push up. I'll run away in a second. You can corner trap here. Reset him so he doesn't dig. Digging is slow. And we'll go back here. Mm. 
Mm. Tebow. Well, let's try not to let him die. That's okay. Killing a melee is not the end of the world. Of course, it insta respawns, whatever. Ideally, I'd have killed a mage there first, but. It's okay. Melees have like 40 health when they respawn. It's like whatever. It's a few pipe shots. I'd like to have killed the bat before the melee. Wasn't really a good way to do it. Whatever. I also dragged that melee, which made it die even slower. So if you can avoid it moving while you kill stuff, that's also good. Chill here a second. Go. Go. Okay, I see that Nibbler is going to come down. There's nothing dangerous here, so I'm just going to stand here and prep. I should have blood barraged it and I could have come straight here and started killing it, but I didn't do that. Unlucky. You can pipe Nibblers from this tile. I can just kill that. And I killed a bad second. Save some time. Monsters die slower when they're moving? Yes, they do. Goals always get to the mage first. It's very minor. It's not the end of the world if you do drag, but it is a uh, time loss. My north pillar's taking a lot of damage. Not really ideal. So I just got to keep that in mind. They've been consistently going for it. Luckily, it's very easy to protect north pillar. So it shouldn't be a big deal. And I barrage those after the, the melee, because he dies slow. Cool, those are all dead. Uh, let's just kill this. And the reasoning for that is I'll kill this. Which means it can either respawn... It can either respawn the bat or the melee, but, you know, it just insta respawns melee, of course. So I had a good odds it wouldn't respawn, but it did. That's okay. And it pulled this blob up, which is good. See how it is. And I want that melee to get closer. Kill you first. Wobble it after. Okay. I'm probably just killing melee. Don't really care. It's not that big of a deal. You can do this quite a bit. Killing melee is not a big deal. Ooh, getting spicy. Might want to confirm that's dead. <laughs> Luckily, I can flake. We're okay. Let's move up. Inspect this. It's not dead yet. Barrage is a five tick and shooting your pipe three times a six tick. So one barrage is worth it. If it kills one, start piping. Okay, let's go here and skip these. You are going to be hovering this tile a lot. Wow. Okay, let's do uh, this. Are we blood barraging instead of ice when full HP? Uh, ice barrage is better on bloblets. I was probably doing it on accident. It's not a big deal. Um, blood barrage is always better on nibblers because then they clump up better. Even if the DPS is a little bit worse, it doesn't matter for nibblers because they're like your full accuracy on them anyway. I can't flick right now. It's lost. Any day this dies, I'm going to move over here. That was a huge pipe spec. Cool. 
That was with no occult on. Okay, easy. Huge. I should have blubberized that. Okay, I can get around here. So I'm going to do this. Cool. And I can actually pipe that from here. Okay, now we have two melees. Important setup. Stand here. You do this a lot. So anytime you're like flicking on this side of, of pillar, this should be your default. Go here. Because when these guys dig, go here. And you're using the mage as a pillar. Let's give it one blood barrage. It's not worth it. I'm like full HP. You're going to do that in the 50s a ton. We're almost to 50. Almost like I was told that yesterday for some reason. For some reason. I was helping Diesel with his cape earlier. Uh, we've got time. Pick up the sand fees. Okay. Cool. Free wave. Love it. Anytime the, the mage spawns here, it's great. That's ideal. I'm not potted. Yikes. When uh, mage is low HP, piping it is better than T-bowing. 34 is the cutoff, so once it's below 34 HP, you can start piping. If it's nearby anyway, might as well. Okay, I'm going to go get this nibbler because I know it's not dead. It's still not dead. Okay, everything's pulled in now. It's not dead yet. Just pipe it. Cool. Okay, I'm not going to wait for this to pull everything in either. I'm going to kill this and move over there. Cool. So I save some time on the movement. A lot of the little like movement stuff can save you a lot of time. Just like being ready to move up. I should kill the ranger first. Run a little faster. Not a big deal. Okay. Be very careful going here because that mage can't see you on this tile. Alright, let's wait for him to pull up. Attack. Mage. Gonna do a lot of off ticking. So, big thing with the sub-65 is not being afraid to off-tick stuff. Like, just send it. It's not very hard. And if you force yourself to do it, you'll learn it pretty quick. It's not that bad. I use the time of killing those bats to pull this up, so it's kind of convenient. Okay. Okay. For those to pull in. You just gotta always be careful with that because when you go for the nibblers like that, they can see you. <clears throat> Pronounce a word. No monkey is a heavy. No monkey in a heavy Japanese accent. There's no way I can do that without sounding racist. It's lost. <laughs> We're not doing that. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> oh my god. Peace. One cast, kill this. Crisis averted. We're good. Almost got him. Almost. All right, that's dead. 40 XP drop. You can just camp mage frame. Flicking bats is nice because it prevents stat drain, but it doesn't matter that much. If it's going to give you a mage hit for it, don't do it. I think elf mode is probably done. Okay, we're normal mode now.
Really good opportunity for health there if you have this set up too. Prey range back up. You can blood barrage everything there. Gorgeous. Give this a shot. Shoot this. I do not want to shoot that blob again. Oh, that was stupid. Punished? Never. Okay. If I was punished, uh, just start flicking. Just relax. Maybe I took a 70 there. I'm at 20 HP now. That's okay. I can blood barrage the bloblets after and we'd be fine. Can also just brew. You've got four brews. You need like one for Zuck, probably. If that. Like, don't be afraid to chug brew. It's not a big deal. Mistakes do happen. Uh. Great clicks. Nice. Oh yeah, and I don't care about nibblers, like at all. <laughs> Unless you're gonna save me time. Don't care. Only a north pillar. Okay. So yeah, it's just get on the mage as quick as you can. And you can always pump damage into something. You can shoot a ranger while waiting. That's totally fine. You're gonna shoot him later anyway. Doesn't matter. Just always be attacking something. It's the name of the game. Also, click better. Be better than me. And you can phantom these two. I'll just keep that in mind. It's an option for more health. Hey, make sure Ranger and Major aren't... I'm just waiting for an attack of the one closest to me. So, let's say I have Major here and Ranger... Uh, it's an example. He's just waiting for the attack to move up. So if I want to off-tick here... Boom. Can do it again. Just wait for an attack. Attack, go. That's it. Not that hard. It's really not. I'll, my priority is kill melees first. And I always stand here so I can do this. Priority is still kill melees first. And use my downtime to move up to here. Ideally, I kill the ranger first here. Unlucky XP drops. That's okay. Eric mate with the primer. Thank you so much, man. Okay, go get that. That was bad. Mistakes were made. Is there a good way to get to the mage here? You can kill this. Let's just pick off... I'd rather pick off a melee than a ranger, because a, a ranger respawn is way worse. So let's just pick that off and get to, get to work. I could have come down here and off-tick them as well. There's many options. It doesn't really matter. It's not that deep. Like, you can find pretty good solutions and you will get a good time. Look at the pace. Like, I haven't done anything that ridiculous and we are very ahead. So. Okay. We're going to blood barrage these nibblers. Should get most of our health back. It's okay to be starting on kind of lowish health. That's fine. Put a pipe spec in you. I'm going to take out the bats. This is a very good spawn. Okay, he attacked. Perfect. Why ideally Ranger first? Because Ranger dies slow. Not that slow, but he's slower than a Nibbler. Nibbler dies really fast. Okay. And I can actually just pipe this. Priorities melees, they die slow. I'm gonna phantom these nibblers, cause never mind. <laughs> Alright. Oh, another thing you can do if you need some health, you can do Pipe Baragas. 
But like, make sure it's dead though. Like that. So I got like seven health there. Doesn't waste any time if you do it properly. Can be really, really nice. Phantom? Well, they're phantoms now. Pillar's a little low, but it's not a big deal. Should be okay. I'm used to going faster, so pillar going down isn't really ever a threat, but... Alright, let's go up here. Um, you know what? I want health. I'm scared. I'm shivering. I'm My teeth are chattering. I'm gonna die. Relax. Get some health. I'm down 40 HP. We're going to 61. Cool. Full health. Easy. Didn't even waste so much time for it. Okay, those are dead. All right, there's an awkward spawn. I see a problem. It's fine. Okay, we're good standing here. Kill this bat. Kill the bat. Ow! <laughs> you fucking punched me, bro! Oh! <laughs> That's fucked because of the blocking? No way with that. Okay. That's fucked up. Okay. We're gonna do this. And we're gonna use Bruce. Easy. And we're fine once again. That was that was a messed up setup. <laughs> Hit those nibblers. Should be dead. It's okay, I prayed mage just in case that would happen. This is a really bad spawn. This is tricky. If I stepped out and did a pillar stack, I'd be getting hit right now. Let's do this. Fuck it. Okay. That's called a splash off tick. When you splash on a mage, it stalls it by two ticks, allowing you to off tick. Kind of rare that this is a, a circumstance for it, but made sense in this case. That only works if it has not respawned anything. So now it wouldn't work. We're fine. That was a good that was a good case for it. That was a good case for a splash off tick. It's a bad spawn. If it's you and you don't know you can do that, you now know you can do that, but if you don't know you can do that, you just wait for the melee to dig. It's not the end of the world. Block this. Are we on tick? Nope. I'm so bad at setting this up. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Fuck it. Just come here. Who cares? I'm dying. Brew. 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 Uh, 
Oh, I took that. Restore the stats. Blood barrage everything. I can uh, phantom that other blob. Should be good. Don't panic if you're like having an issue. You brought Breeze for a reason. Obviously, that was really sloppy. It's okay. Gee, Masoka. Kind of good that there's a couple sloppy waves. It'll happen. But watch my health. Three. We're good. Um. Kill this fast. Get these off. That's annoying. Oh, that's really cool. <laughs> Alright. I'm trying not to do two tick setups, which is why that like happened on the last wave, so it's like... <laughs> Because a lot of people going for this wouldn't know 2-tick. Okay. You may be like, it looks like your supplies are low. I have infinite supplies. Do not take Rigor off. Rigor doesn't stop. I have enough supplies <laughs> for eons. We're going to end this with like over two sand for you. This sucks. Relax, just chill. Pray range, this guy can see you. Wow, this really sucks. Okay, we can do this. Anguish? Good idea. <laughs> Have a chat who can remind you when you're equipping the wrong items? That helps too. Speed you up. <laughs> That's huge for the speed. I've seen people try to do speed runs and they get so nervous that they're going to run out of prayer. Like in this situation, they start going, oh, oh it's over. I don't have prayer? I'm going to stop using rigor. What? No? Huh? Let's drag this guy in so he gets hit by the pillar. The way pillar works is it does exactly half of the HP of the monster remaining. Big 77. You don't have to one tick flick this at all. You don't have to do this. Not necessary. Get that one low, attack the other one, attack him. Easy. Okay. Alright. Always stand here. Always stand here. The reason I do this is so it delays my Tebow shot, so I have more time to tag. Don't stand in a random tile. Stand here. Stand here. Always. Push in. I think that's sent. It didn't. Come back. Push in. I don't know why I bothered equipping that. Just pipe these. Pray melee. Cool. Jad nuzzles here. Holy. Cool. You can quick get a blood barrage off if you've got time. I don't need HP, but maybe you do. <laughs> All right. We can stand one away. It doesn't matter too much for triples. I can delay my shot again, like I was talking about.
You always want to stand here as well, because if it blocks a healer behind you, you can avoid taking damage from it. Not getting hit by healers is pretty nice. That's okay. Gotta tank this one, whatever. I think I'm gonna do a Jad skip, because it's required for the diary anyway. I feel like if you're going for sub 65, you'll also be able to Jad skip. At the very least. And I'll kill everything else, sure. Using a bit of prayer here because I'm not even bothering to flick. I normally flick the hell out of triples, but I'm just big chilling. The nice thing about standing here is that corn traps these, so they can't even hit you. I'm going to step here after and blood barrage all three of these. Unlucky? Tried? Doesn't matter. Okay. Rigger on. Right click Zuck. Attack. I don't know why it shows us not having Rigger on. That's weird. <laughs> okay, now I actually don't have it on. Okay. Rager stays on. Uh, it's mage first? Okay, cool. Yeah, fuck off ticking these. Don't do that. But the shield! Me, 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 me. Are we no setting? There's no way. Okay. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, I'd, I'd be actually mad. We almost did. Keep shooting here. Okay, go get him. It's a little scary. We're good, though. Cool. Just brew up to full. Might as well. Beautiful. Send here. One more chance. Okay, we wait. I don't have chins, so I'll just play this chill. Just relax. I get a little nastier with chins, but wait for the shield to start moving. Okay, we're good. Senders? It's okay. <laughs> I'm not molding. Are you molding? I'm not molding. No, I just have to hit an eight or a, a nine. Can we get, can we play the game? Oh, cool, cool, cool. Okay, just checking. I'm so used to skipping. <laughs> I kill all the healers. What? 
What? <laughs> Wait. All right, no. 